Okay, first, we're gonna take a piece of cardboard here, put that down first, and put our paper over that cardboard. We need something like cardboard or a stack of newspapers or other paper for the needle part of the compass to dig into. Next, we want to mark the center point where our circle is going to be drawn from. We set the needle on that point and adjust the radius so that it fits on the paper. We're going to draw a nice big circle. We'll scribe the circle by turning the compass tool with one or two hands. There's our circle. Next, we're going to divide the circle with a radius. When you do it, do it really lightly. I'm doing it dark so you can see it. So you're going to go from one side to the other side. Now, I haven't changed the radius on the compass. I'm going to take that radius and use that. I'm going to put the needle now on one end of the diameter line that I just drew and I'm going to mark both sides of the circumference with, the com with that radius here and then I'm going to switch it up. I'm going to put it at the opposite end and I'm going to mark up at this end. Now what I've just done is I've divided it into six equal sections. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now I can connect these sections to make different geometric shapes. For example, we could go from this point to this point and then over to this point here to make an equilateral triangle. And finally, to here. There's our equilateral triangle. We can go further. We can make a six-pointed star if we make another equilateral triangle with the remaining three points, here, here, and here. Okay, now notice we've got a hexagon inside here. We could just as easily have made a large hexagon by connecting up all the six points that we made when we first divided up the circle. There's our hexagon. We can go further still and we can draw a smaller star inside of this hexagon here. We just have to add in two more diameter lines first. One here, one here. Now all we got to do is connect up these points on the hexagon to start our next star. Oops. I messed up here. I'll have to erase that. And now you can see we can go further and further and we can make an infinite series of triangles and stars inside here, one after the other, as long as you can see what you're doing, sharpen your pencil point, and make those lines.